everyone welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new in today's video i have done a little bit of valentine's day decor shopping and then i'm going to be doing a little bit of decorating but first i want to show you what i picked up while i was out today i did go to hobby lobby and i really didn't find much there i mean i got everything there but they just didn't have a lot it's probably a little late to be going i'm sure they didn't have a lot of stuff to begin with so things were being condensed and picked over but i did get a few things and i think that i'm going to make a wreath for my front door and i don't know why because i already have a really cute valentine's day wreath on my front door um but i went and i'll show you the first thing that i got is this adorable heart on a stake and I wanted to go there to get these in red because I had a whole idea planned that I was going to use these for and the wreath on my door is red so it was all going to um, just go together and I know that pink and red go together for Valentine's Day but I was just like I just couldn't make it work so <clears throat> I got two of these that's all they had I wanted I really wanted the red ones so um, I changed my theme to pink and I decided that I would make a wreath out of these um, that was pink instead because the wreath on my door is red and I wanted to do like a garland around the door but whatever I do I guess it's going to be mainly pink now but these are so cute they were $6.99 and I like 40 or 50 percent off I don't even know but um, if I had another Hobby Lobby nearby, I would go to see if they had more because I just think they are so fun. A wreath, um, a blank wreath. I really don't know why I'm making a wreath, but I wanted like a long one. So I got just this oblong grapevine wreath. It was like $5.99. Um, and then I got some floral picks that I'm going to in there and I don't know if I got enough or or really what I'm gonna do I just it was hard to like come up with a vision of what I wanted to do since I wanted to do everything in red and I switched to pink but I think I'm gonna do pink flowers with a red red hearts but I did get some little red hearts so we'll see I got a bunch of these really cute pink floral stems and they're just so cute uh they were $11.99 and all the florals were thankfully 50% off on this day. They do alternate every week, so I guess I went on the right week. I've got like three of these. Um, I got three of these, which I'm not putting these on the bush. I'm going to do like a little planter. Sure, but they're they're really pretty. It's just this um, light green colored greenery with little pink buds on it and i just thought it was really cute and it went good with the um the little pink hearts i just want so many of these so maybe i can find some more um i did get a couple other stems i got a couple of these and they were um 50 off 6.99 and then i end up with one of these which was um 50 off 9.99 um what else did i get since i didn't get the big red hearts i found these smaller red hearts um, and they are also glittery and it was a pack of five so these are nice there's so many things that you could do with these so i'm gonna use these in my valentine's day wreath as well I may really like this and go back and um, add some more stuff to it. But in the store, I was like really struggling with trying to figure out what I was going to do. And uh, so, yeah, I'm just thought, let me get what I've got in my cart and I'll go home and see what I can put together. I really wanted to do something fun for Valentine's Day. It was feeling pretty bland around here. Oh, and I got this. Um, I've seen this before and never really thought about it. And this would have worked better in red but i got this heart that says happy valentine's day in pink so it was a big pink heart and i'll put it either in my little planter or on the wreath i haven't decided how i'm going to use it yet but 
that is what we're gonna do. We're gonna put together the arrangement for the front door. And they had a really pretty red heart doormat, but it just didn't look like it was gonna go with all the stuff that I had, so I didn't get that. I also got a little container of these super cute Valentine's Day sprinkles. They're like multiple different sizes of balls and I've got a fun little treat that I'm gonna make and I'm gonna use these to make them with. I went into Joanne because I figured I needed some ribbon to go on my wreath and now that I'm looking at it, this just looks so blah. But um, they have some really cute ribbon but it wasn't what it didn't have wire in it and I really feel that I need wire for what I'm doing so I just got this light pink shimmery um, ribbon. I ran to Home Goods. And look at this amazing basket that I got. Oh my God, I'm so obsessed with this. I really needed a new basket to put my blankets and stuff in because I just have stuff everywhere. I have no closet space, nowhere to put anything. So baskets like this come in really handy. Um, I, I did just clean out our linen closet and there's so many things that i am either going to have to get rid of or find a place to store. So whatever I'm keeping, I'm just going to put in here. They had a second one, but it was a little bit smaller. I just got the big one. I kind of probably should have got both of them because they're just so nice. I love the color. I love the handles and this really nice ball on top. And then the lid, you just cut this off. That They just got it tied on there. And then this isn't like a wicker basket material. It is um, kind of like, it feels plastic, um, but in a good way. I have several baskets like this that I bought they're like the ones that I bought before said they were indoor outdoor baskets so I use them to put like um I have a little one by my washer and I put like dish rags and stuff in it so that if I put them in there and they're kind of wet it's not like it's going to mold the basket or anything so I really love those types of baskets for that reason um this one doesn't say anything about indoor outdoor, but this one was $49.99 and the smaller one was $39.99, but that was a good find. And I was only in there for like 10 minutes. I didn't have a lot of time. I just breezed through. There was so many cute things, lots of adorable Easter stuff coming in, but I'm really just trying to focus on one thing at a time right now. I did need some new bath sponges, so I got these really cute pink ones. And then for my treat with the sprinkles, I got this fun bag of marshmallows. They're just so cute. So that'll be fun for a Valentine's Day treat. All right, that is it for my Valentine's Day haul. Now let's get started on putting this wreath together. All right, you guys, I just made another shopping trip to the Dollar Tree and I just had to run into town to get something and I thought I might as well go by the Dollar Tree while I was near to see if they had any stuff to decorate my front porch area. I really don't know what I'm trying to do here. I'm just like putting together um, this idea that I want to create. So I have no idea if it's going to work, but I saw some cute stuff at the Dollar Tree. Oh. And the marshmallows that I got, if you'll remember, these, they're really cool and they're long and they're pink and they're white, but they had heart marshmallows there for a dollar or I guess maybe they're dollar twenty-five now. I got a few things at the Dollar Tree. So what is this? Is it a dollar or a dollar twenty-five? I really don't know, but I got this cute little welcome sign. It is pink and red. I just love pink and red together. And I'm thinking that this could look cute on my wreath that I'm trying to make. Um, now I'm thinking like, should I have gotten that weird long one? But we'll make it work. Um, I'll figure it out. I don't know how, but I'll figure it out. So when I went to the Dollar or Hobby Lobby, I'm one of those big sparkly hearts. You know, I think I'm going to regret this purchase because it's just not the same. It's not the same. And I want to cry, but I bought some hearts. <laughs> at the Dollar Tree, I got these ones, which I like these, they're foam hearts. And can you spray paint foam? I feel like if you spray paint foam, it like disintegrates, but I don't know. I got some pink spray paint, so I am gonna spray paint these and we'll see what happens, but I thought they would be cute uh, for what I'm trying to do. So I got four of those. 
but so cute, right? And then I got three of these glittery heart picks. I mean, they would be cute really anywhere in like a bouquet of flowers or maybe just who knows. I thought, you know what? I don't want to be like, oh, I should have got those little heart picks. But the hearts I did get, and now I'm on the fence about this because I really want those glittery hearts because they're so pretty. Whatever I try and do is going to look cheap and tacky, but I got these little wooden hearts. And I thought maybe I could paint them, um, but it's still the glitter for me. But if I don't want to paint them, I thought I could like cut this out, this wrapping paper and put it on there. I don't know if that's a good idea, but I wanted to try it. So I got some uh, fun wrapping paper colors. I mean, when you're in the Dollar Tree, you're just like, let me buy all of this stuff. Cause it's only a dollar. <laughs> And then I got these cute buckets for the boys. Put in their little Valentines. Aren't those adorable? So in love with these. And then I got a bucket for my hubby. It says, love you always. I don't have anything to put in the buckets, but in case I pick something up and I'm like, you know, I wish I would have grabbed one of those buckets. So now I've got plenty. And then I got like the cutest Valentine's Day cards. I really just don't even want to go and like spend all that time picking out a Valentine's Day card and then they cost like five, seven, ten dollars. I got these really cute ones um, for one dollar and they're like, and they weren't a dollar twenty five because they actually said one dollar. They're like 3D cards so this actually has little heart confetti in it. It says, you fill my heart with lots of love. So cute. And this one says, I love you very much. And then inside says, a hug from my heart to yours. Happy Valentine's Day. And then this one says, to my Valentine Day, I will love you always and forever. And then inside, well, it's pretty long, but it's really nice card. Um, I really like these cards, so I thought they were really good. Only a dollar, so cute. So I thought if I put like some candy or whatever, I'm gonna put in here and one of those little balloons on the stick. I thought about getting those now, but won't they be deflated by Valentine's Day? Um, so I just didn't get them, but I did get a pack of these heart balloons. I have no idea what I was just saying because my camera just died. Um, but I also got some of this, what do you want to call it? Oh my goodness, I can't think of what it's called, like mesh. Oh, it says right here, decorative mesh. Since I'm making a wreath, I thought I might need some of this decorative mesh and it was so cheap, I could just get a bunch of colors. Um, I got this magenta glittery pink color and it's three yards of mesh so I'm sure it's way more than I need. I got white just because, oops, I dropped one but I got two of these really light pink ones and then I got one of these. So I am about to get crafty. I'm not even a crafty gal but we're gonna get crafting and this is gonna be a difficult process. <laughs> I got taco, a taco kit from Sam, so I don't have to cook dinner, and I've got margaritas, so this definitely calls for a margarita. Um, I have a little planter that I'm going to decorate, and I'm, there's probably like dirt in it. I don't even know, but I had like some mums in it um, in the fall, and it's just sitting out there, so I'm gonna bring it in and see, you know, just work with it, and. I will get back to you guys once I get something figured out what I'm doing. So stick around if you want to see what I'm about to do with all of this Valentine's Day stuff. Zipped. I would love to be one of those people who's just got it all together, but I know. Let's see. Oh, that's not gonna be enough. But I was gonna put these in here. Probably need more and definitely need something like, I put some bags in here, but it's just not quite enough. Oh my goodness, so I took 
the steak off of that and I'm gonna have my husband put it on this and then that will be so cute this is gonna tell me what I need to get whenever I go back definitely some more of those now I can't wait to go to Hobby Lobby tomorrow I don't even like Hobby Lobby you guys but I think that will be super cute I definitely need more of these flowers there wasn't a lot at all I wish we had a Michaels I wish I, I need I might be able to put this on myself it's just not gonna be that sturdy need this on a stick stick out of this <gasps> my pot has a big hole in it <laughs> oh my gosh Let's turn that to the back nobody's gonna see that but that was a bummer so I think this on a stick will be cute but I don't have a I don't have the a stick right now maybe put some of these in here they have cute little like be my oh that's so cute so cute now how am I going to incorporate red you guys this is, this is a lot because I might it's hard I don't know like when I see something like this that is pink and red I think is the cutest thing ever but like when I'm trying to put pink and red together, I'm like, what? This does not, it like kind of cheapens it. You know what? We're just going to be fun. I think that'll be cute on a big stick. Maybe it could be like a two tier. I think. I think that'll be cute. Right guys? Wreath, oh my gosh. I think this welcome sign really just did the trick with the wreath. I'll show you the wreath I have on my door now. It's so beautiful. It looks better than what I'm making. See, that looks better. just don't know this is a shit show i am going to practice on what i'm doing with my wreath and then we will reconvene in a moment okay so it is the next day and i did a little bit more shopping i'm here in the floor i've got a big mess I don't know what I was thinking. I did see a garland at Hobby Lobby today that would have been great, but I'm thinking like, what what am I doing here? You know what I mean? Like how into this am I going to get? So I think I'm just kind of gonna do an over the door swag. And I already had this, and I was really trying to incorporate red into this, but it's really just, mm, I don't know, bothering me. I'm gonna take my boots off. I literally just walked in the door I've only got, I don't know, like an hour and a half before I have to get the boys and little bear. <sighs> we're, we're having some issues, some poo poo issues because it's like stuck to her and I was about to walk out the door and I had to put her in the bathroom. I kind of like rinsed her off, but she needs a whole like shampoo and I just can't, I don't, I don't even know. So she's, she's outside right now. Um, so I'm going to try and quickly figure out what I'm going to do. I got a few more florals. Um, honestly, I could have just kept going and going. 
I put pink paper on this. I'm not loving it, I gotta be honest. It looks pretty cheap, but I was doing it last night. And my husband has some pink paint. He was actually took our pink paint to do a project for my razor, so um, he has some paint that he said, it's probably that color, but I don't know. I might not even use that because look what I found when I went back to Hobby Lobby today. They just had one random one. Someone must, I have no idea where it was. It must have been misplaced, even though I like scoured the store. So now I have three of them. And honestly, I went to buy red ones, but I don't know. We're going to pink. The red, even these little red things hanging off is really throwing me off. I got more florals, all pink, of course. And I went to a different Dollar Tree because I thought these little picks, at first I didn't like them, but I don't know, they're kind of cute. I took the stick out and I thought, since I really didn't have any nice looking hearts, I would use these. Um, so I only had, I don't even know, I think I just had this one. Um, so I went back to see if they had more at this other Dollar Tree and they did. I was in luck. And then I'm like, how many do I get? That's the problem. I, I just want to buy them all and then I'm like, I just, whatever I don't use, whatever. But I mean, that adds up, all that stuff. So I'm like, I don't know. But look how adorable these look. I'm in love with the pink and red together. I'm trying to make it work on the um, on this garland, but whenever I put it on there, it just looks out of place. And you know, maybe it's because of the greens in the garland, but honestly, I think I bought one of these and I already had one. Um, so when I was looking today, I thought about getting more, but I don't know. Something was pulling me away. I did get um, this stem, which I didn't have before, and it has some green on it, but I like it because it kind of just cascades. Um, and I thought it'd be nice for the end, so I did put it on the end over here, kind of like, kind of just sticking everything where I want it before I mount it on. Oh my God, let me deal with the dogs. I put foil on this heart. Um, I kind of messed it up, but Ooh, look, it's reflective. I don't know. Not a fan of the way these look. So I don't know if I'm going to use them. I'm so happy I found the third one. So maybe I won't have to use them at all. Or uh, my paper's coming off. I could do like kind of layer it to make it look like a big heart. But we're not totally seeing how, um, how it looks. Honestly... I don't know about that color. I mean, you know, it's just kind of, might do something like this. But what I did was I pulled the um, stick off of these. The first one I did was real easy. Um, the other one I kind of had to work at it. So it's glued and there's like six little staple like nails in there. I will do that later when I'm like, have more time. Now I just love pink and hearts and I have so many of them right now. I feel like I could do, I feel like I could do so many fun projects. Oh, I forgot to show you. I was walking out of the Dollar Tree with just the things that I wanted when I spotted these hearts. <laughs> Look how freaking cute they are. They were a dollar twenty-five. I mean, I'm like, I don't know what I'm going to do with these, but I got to grab a few. There was this pink one that says, be mine. And the red one that says, sweetheart. So I got two sweethearts, two be mines. And there was only one of these, and it's kind of a purple color. Um, very similar to the pink, but it's purple. And it says, love. Oh. So cute, right? Like, um, oh my gosh, that heart that I have outside that says happy Valentine's day. I'm like, uh, I don't know. I don't know if I like it anymore. I think I could replace it and stick these in my planter. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Or if I had like two planters and my door was cement, 
If I had two planters and my door was symmetrical, like I only have one side window on my door, which drives me crazy because I love for everything to be symmetrical. So if I'm putting something on at my door that normally people put one on each side, I can't because I only have one side. But if there were two sides, uh deceased like but there wasn't not another love i guess i could have got two beam oh my goodness so cute i gotta pry all the sticks off of these and i'll show you how it's looking so far so far it's looking like this but it's just gonna go around the top of my door obviously these sticks aren't going to be here and um, this is kind of just like the rough draft. And I'm going to wire everything in. And I'm going to run the hearts down this way as well. But you know what? I, I'm really happy. It was just meant to be to find that third one. And now I don't really have to worry about these that I spent. I don't know. I bought seven of them at $1.25. So it's kind of a waste. But... I don't know. Maybe I could do something with them. I only have like 3,000 hearts. Could save them for next year. Or I could paint them, but if I don't have to paint, why paint? All right, you guys, this is the finished look. I think it turned out so cute. I put all these little hearts in the planter with the bushes, and then I've got the garland hung over the door, and I just love how everything turned out um, just ignore the scratch marks on the door i need to touch that up with some stain that was really bothering me but i didn't have time to do all that but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and make sure you leave a comment down below and don't forget to subscribe if you are not subscribed and i will see you in my next one bye